What's up YouTube? Welcome back to another video and today we're going to take a look at Man United legend Roy Keane. sound like Basin. So guys, we're gonna take a look at Roy Keane. So Roy Keane got himself, uh, I think his icon card, the prime version is a 90 rated and this card is 92 rated, uh, I mean 91. So look at that, he's going around 735. Yo, is that a snipe? Is that a good price? Go, 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 go. Let's check what his price was. Oh my God, I'm gonna make his coins. FIFA Trader FC. Uh, hourly base, uh, nah, 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 I just, I just got scammed, I was on the verge to get scammed, but, you know, shout out to Fitbin for not letting me scammed. Okay, so, he has 2 star, 3 star, which is a big downside, medium high, that's very good for a CDM, and let's start off, pace, good, shooting, good for a CDM. Passing, amazing, look at that, 89 vision, almost 90, 93 short passing, 91 long passing, so you don't need more for him. Dribbling wise, again, look at that, 94 reaction with 93 uh, composure, and an overall very, very good stats in the dribbling wise. Now, the key stats with this card is that 91 defending alongside the 91 physicality, which is just insane. Look at that, Moyer, he has 96 interceptions, with 97 aggression, but so this card is like purely your main CDM that will play for you. Uh, and not, he doesn't have any trade, and he played my guy 12 games, I mean 12 years for, at Man United. So this card is really looking juiced up, and uh, he's around 700k right now, as you can see. So I think this card, after a month or two, will be like let's say around 400k just he's that price because he doesn't have supply and the icon moments sbc didn't came around so give this guy like a month and he will be around 350 400 i will say which is a very good very good price at at that peak you know so i just want to go on footbin because i just want to show you guys something really really, really interesting the boost that he got on this prime version is significant and look at what he got plus eight pace now that's very amazing that's significant now look at that plus 11 on the sprint speed and plus six on the acceleration so that's a very very big upgrade and they made his card from not usable to usable you know and that's very very good thing to see from EA Sports now the plus shooting uh, plus two shooting is irrelevant I would say but the plus one passing is good and look at that man he got plus four on the dribbling but plus 10 on the agility plus six on the balance now they transform this card from when you pack him you're gonna say meh you're gonna say you sports you know from telling yourself yeah i got myself a usable card and i will give this card a shout out you know i will try this card out so that's a very very good option that EA sports gave and that's I really, I really think that's impressive from me sports. And finally, boys, plus two on the defending and physicality all around the board. Now, compared to his last year card, I want to check what was his upgrade from last year. So last year, he got 77 pace, which this year has like plus three. Wow, this year, he, he last year he got 83 shooting, but sorry for that, boys. My camera is interrupted. I mean, I hope right now it's good. Let me check, sorry, sorry for that guys. So yeah, you got, it. that's that's okay. So as I was saying, last year, as you can see, he had 83 shooting, which this year he has 73 shooting. So that's a very, very big downside on the card. 86 passing is the same, 83 dribbling on the last, last year's card for, and this year he has 85, and defending he has plus two on this year's card. But I think for me, this 83 shooting, I mean, yeah, it's good, but, because he has the two stars, three star skill moves, it's irrelevant to give this card the pace and the shooting boost because you, you don't want this card to attack and create chances for you because you can't with that two star, three star, it's, it's impossible. So for me, giving the boost on the pace 
and the dribbling is significant, the more significant than giving the boost on shooting. So without further ado, boys, I just want to check his prime. I mean, look at that, 134k, and that's why I said uh, give this card a month, and he will go around let's say 400k. So without further ado, let's hop into the review and let's see if this card is usable or not. Okay, let's go. Okay, guys, so with Roy Keane, man, I think Roy Keane is finally usable this year. I think the boost that they gave him on the uh, pace, the balance, and the reaction, and in overall the agility, had made this card, as I said, from not usable to very, very usable. So when you pack this card, give this card a shout out. Use this card because he is fun, I mean, I will say fun to use. It's not a card that you will use any year, uh, but this Prime Icon Moments card, shout out to EA Sport for making him usable. Now, I don't think he is the best CDM in the world. I'm not telling you that he's better than Vieta or like Kante, Team of the Year, but as I said, he, he is now entering in the category of usable players. And that's for me very, very significant and very, very good to see. Now, pace wise, he is very responsive, very fast, and he is bully in the midfield. Like, he can, you know, push the guy away and intercept with that 96 interception that he has and 97 aggression, which is very, very impressive. So, uh, playing him as your main CDM is the main goal that you want to have. Don't play this card as uh, your center main, you're like attacking or box to box. Play him as your pure CDM, and I think this guy will provide you the job. And as I said, I don't think it is like a Prime Matthias or Prime Vieta nor of Prime Holly, but give this guy some respect. Give this card the respect that eSport gave him. And I think he is a very, very solid option. And what I felt with this card that is very, very good is his passing. As you saw here, he made very, very impressive passing, which myself, I was impressed. And I loved his passing capabilities. Look at that, man. Long passing to Messi, and look, we scored a goal. And he generated the attack, he started the attack. And for me, that's a very, very good thing to have. Like, intercept the ball, he's agile to make one or two dribblings and pass the ball forward that high pa passing. So for me, I will say that this card is really good. I don't think so what, I don't know what this card will happen throughout team of the season, but from here, from a month or two, I will say that this is a very, very usable card. So if you're on a budget, grab this card, it will be 400K, 500K, and that's a really good option. So thank you guys so much for watching, I will see you on another video, man. Peace.